Have you ever played Half-Life 1? So, at the beginning of the game is this gigantic long ass train ride. I'm just going to sort of skip it. Might have set that a bit too high. Just got to jump out a couple of times and stick it. That's better. Door got a bit munted in the process, but... Now the first thing I'll probably tell you about is the elevators. So, any elevator in this game is kind of pointless. You don't need to take them at all. There's always a way around. Alright, so if you gotta fuck up, then you might as well go for gold. Just slam it in there multiple times. Just keep slamming it. Slamming. So this part's where the game really opens up. As soon as this door's open, we're pretty much free to go as fast as we want. As fast as you can be up at least. So if you're a good beel, but... So this part's where the game... Now, um, you might notice this is that elevator we right before. Uh, and we're still not taking elevators, so just um, hit the ladder there. We don't have a gun at this stage, so... I don't actually think we need that gun. Oh shit, I found a gun anyway. Just gonna show you a quick trick about this elevator. Um, not this elevator, I'm just gonna skip this one, but... Okay, so this elevator here. So, if you press that button, jump back outside and hit the outside of the lift, there's actually a level load trigger on the outside, so you don't have to ride the elevator at all. If you jump inside the scientist here, you can use him as a boost to make the jump for the ladder. If you don't do it right though, he ends up just teleporting back in the room. This kind of bugs the game out because the zombie's supposed to claw him, but now he's in a window, so... Uh, we sort of need that shotgun set. Um, the military in this game is just notorious for love and grenades. Uh, just gonna... Yep, it's dangerous. Here, yeah, crabby, 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 crabby. Once these doors open, you just wanna jump down to the bottom, because it's another elevator, and there's a boss fight coming up here. Um, the best way to beat the boss is just to skip it. Build a trip mine staircase over here. Once you're over, you're pretty much in the clear. Freeman, I've been waiting for you. One of your scientist pals said to give you a message. You're supposed to take this old rail system up to some kind of satellite delivery rocket. I don't know where it is exactly, and the old guy was so worried about it. Oh, oh no, there's a there's some traps in here. I can't get out, I'm I'm trapped. How am I going to get past these traps? Still crouching strafe jump through the gap. Be up down the tunnel here. Bypass these enemies. Skip these ones as well. Here we are, probably the slowest elevator in the whole game. You can see it's taking, taking its time. Uh, there's just there's enemies everywhere. Jump down. Take this ladder. Ah oh, yeah, so there's like, it's like a giant fish in here. What's up guys, Desync here. We're about to go fishing. Um, I remember the fish being less, um... We're just gonna leave that one alone. I'm sure you do, but I just... Being ambushed by like 40 dudes. Where are we taking this Freeman guy? Topside for questioning. What the hell for? We got him. Let's kill him now. So I should probably mention this is the unpatched release build of Half Life, but it's no match for no clip. Okay, it's a match for no clips, not working. Freeman, right? I got a match. Yeah, Bonnie, well, I don't want to hear it. Alright, I didn't glitch out this time. So, we're in a dumpster, like a garbage compactor. Uh, one interesting thing about these compacting arms is they're actually trains. So, hop on, press the use key, and just stop them in the tracks. Go 
Gordon Freeman. It is you, isn't it? Sap superpower in a map. would be to find someone with scanner access who can open the front door. I'm pretty sure there's a few scientists hiding somewhere in the labs. Maybe with both of us looking, we can trust them.